Hi everyone, today we're diving into a topic that hits close to home for many of us, the best firearms for home defense. From pistols to shotguns, rifles to revolvers, we'll cover a range of options suitable for every preference and situation. Get ready to arm yourself with knowledge and make decisions that ensure your home is a fortress of safety and security. Shoots like a carbine, holsters like a pistol. That's the pitch behind the new Flux Defense Raider system designed to transform the Sig Sauer P320 into a personal defense weapon. The Flux Defense Raider adds a retractable stock, a Picatinny rail, and a second magazine that doubles as a forward grip to the Sig P320 pistol. Working together, the stock and forward grip greatly enhance the pistol's control, range, and accuracy by allowing shooters to shoulder and fire their weapon like a rifle, while the extra magazine boosts the SIG's P320 standard 17 or 21 round capacity to 43 rounds. According to Flux Defense, the converted weapon is both smaller and lighter than most PDWs on the market, weighing just 2.8 pounds without ammo and measuring just 10.75 inches long with the stock collapsed. But it's worth noting that at $399 a piece and a 43-round capacity, the Raider presents a compelling alternative to the roughly $1,500 per weapon price tag on the 30-round 9mm PCC. The elephant in the room is this bullpup shotgun. Not in length, as it's merely 2 inches longer than a Mossberg shockwave, but in its overall bulk. Nonetheless, the TS-12 proves surprisingly manageable and rewards users who adapt to its dimensions. This gas-operated, semi-automatic 12-gauge boasts impressive firepower, offering a capacity of 15 plus 1 shells with its 3-tube rotating magazine. Unfortunately, tube rotation is manual and may require some practice to master. IWI's design makes for a true fighting shotgun boasting ease of maneuverability and relatively comfortable operation. Particularly helpful is a reversible charging handle that's easily accessible and adaptable to your dominant hand or shooting style. Other noteworthy features include a 3-inch chamber, M-lock compatible rails, compatibility with Benelli chokes, and a cross-bolt safety. Remarkably light for its size at a mere 8 pounds thanks to a polymer chassis, you might expect more recoil from the 18.5-inch barreled bullpup, but the gas operation keeps the gun rather tame. Don't be deterred by its size, the TS-12 is a top-of-the-line defender and one of the finest bullpup shotguns available. Q's Honey Badger is what happens when you want an AR to be roughly the size of an MP5 SD with much better performance. This little fella is teeny tiny. We're talking a short 7-inch barrel and an overall length of 26 to 31 inches, depending on the stock position. When a can is threaded on, the gun goes quiet but remains reliable and accurate. Q's Honey Badger wears a 70-degree selector switch, a three-position PDW-type stock, a two-stage match trigger, and a Q-Cherry Bomb muzzle brake. At only 5 pounds and some change, the Honey Badger is an SMG that gives users a very high degree of versatility. From several hundred yards to up-close home defense ranges, the Honey Badger is a serious contender for the best home defense weapon ever. Reliability and accuracy are top-notch, and while the ergonomics are different, they're far from bad. The Honey Badger is a fierce little fella that packs a lot of power in a short and light package. Designed for special operations with an emphasis on lethality, durability, and reliability, the HK-45 is one of the easier 45 pistols to shoot, and the company claims its patented recoil reduction system will increase accuracy and service life. A welcome addition, although the 45 ACP cartridge's recoil is generally exaggerated. The full-size version of the HK-45 has a 4.5-inch barrel, weighs 31 ounces unloaded, and takes a 10-round magazine. The pistol is 8 inches long, 1.4 inches wide, and 5.7 inches high. The frame is made from polymer, while the slide is made from forged steel. The HK-45 is available from the factory in black, olive drab, and tan, and the slide is finished in a ferretic nitrocarburizing finish to resist wear, tear, and corrosion. In addition to the full-size model, the HK-45 is sold in compact and tactical versions. The primary difference between the three models is overall length and barrel length, with the tactical version having the longest barrel and the compact version a shorter 3.89-inch barrel. It has a high level of reliability, with more than one HK-45 put through a 50,000-round shooting test. B&T's APC-10 emerges as a cutting-edge contender in the 10mm realm, boasting innovation and sleek design. 
Much like its predecessor, the APC-9, the gun employs a straight blowback system complete with an integral buffer. The buffer effectively takes the bite out of the potent 10mm cartridge, rendering shooting experiences smoother and more manageable. A standout feature of the APC-10 is its compatibility with Glock 20 magazines, readily available and easy to find. From dual non-reciprocating folding charging handles to intuitive lower receiver controls, the firearm offers a user-friendly experience that caters to both left- and right-handed shooters. The trigger deserves a special mention. With a light and crisp action, it facilitates precise shooting, enhancing overall accuracy. Just toss an optic and this powerhouse transforms into a formidable tool for home defense. If you're looking for a shotgun that can fit multiple roles, the Mossberg 590 stands out as an excellent choice. Whether for defense or hunting, this firearm proves its worth. Equipped with a 20-inch barrel, it offers enhanced velocity compared to its 18-inch counterparts, making it highly effective for bird shooting. As per the insights gathered from experts, its barrel length strikes a balance, offering maneuverability in defensive scenarios while ensuring accuracy for hitting moving targets at a distance. Moreover, the Mossberg 590 boasts extensive aftermarket support, allowing you to customize it with different stocks and barrels according to your preferences. The Mossberg 500 and 590 series of shotguns are an American staple, rivaling the longevity and reliability of the 870. One notable advantage of the 590 over the 870 lies in its full ambidextrous design, featuring a safety position to top the receiver rather than the cross-bolt configuration of the 870. For those seeking a dependable American-made shotgun and are not concerned about carrying a little extra weight around, the Mossberg 590 is highly recommended. Gotta have at least one double-action revolver on the list, right? The Ruger GP100 is my favorite wheel gun hands down. If the Glock 17 is the Timex of semi-automatic pistols, then the Ruger GP100 is the Timex of revolvers thanks to the investment casting construction and triple-locking cylinder. The GP100 will keep on perking right along after being subjected to loads that will literally blow up a Smith or Colt. When you see reloading manuals with sections that state, for Ruger guns only, that ought to tell you something. Not only that, but between that heavy-duty construction and the rubber grips, the gun's an absolute joy to shoot, enabling superb accuracy and shooting comfort even with full house magnum loads. The M489 is Sons of Liberty flagship rifle and sports some unique features. Sons of Liberty M4s are AR-15 size rifles with the standard direct impingement operating system, offered in 5.56 NATO, 300 Blackout, and 6.5 Grendel. The M489 guns sport Sons of Liberty's new M89 handguard. It's designed to be an improvement over their previous M76 handguard, which will still be available. This multi-purpose rifle comes factory equipped with a Liberty Fighting Trigger, a combat-grade barrel topped with a Knox muzzle device, an A5H2 recovery buffer, a Radian Raptor charging handle, and an ambidextrous safety, all focused on providing the shooter with the smooth and comfortable operation experience of a sports rifle with the reliability of a weapon that can also be used for combat. The Sons of Liberty M489 has an average price of $2,000. If speed's the key, then the 1301 Tactical is for you. Featuring the reliable blink system, this shotgun delivers rounds downrange as swiftly as you can pull the trigger. The self-cleaning and ultra-smooth operating system also contribute to reduced felt recoil, enhancing overall shooting comfort. Designed with the defensive tactical shooter in mind, Beretta's equipped this shotgun with an oversized charging handle and a generously textured bolt release for easy operation in any conditions. The handguard boasts aggressive texturing and features multiple sling mounting points for added versatility. Weighing in at under 7 pounds, this shotgun is among the lightest options available, yet it doesn't sacrifice recoil management. Additionally, it comes with a quality set of rifle sights and a Picatinny top rail, simplifying the process of mounting optics. While there are a few drawbacks to the Beretta 1301, such as its sensitivity to different types of ammunition, it's worth noting that this is a common issue with all semi-automatic shotguns, not just the Beretta. Opting for full power, 2 and 3 quarters, or 3-inch ammunition is recommended to minimize cycling issues. Moreover, the price and availability of the Beretta 1301 may pose challenges as it typically sells for $1,620 and is often out of stock at major retailers. However, if you're seeking a semi-automatic shotgun that's robust and reliable, the Beretta 1301 Tactical is a solid choice.